Smart glasses are no longer a futuristic dream. They're here, practical, and more exciting than ever. Today, we're diving deep into Rokit glasses versus Meta's Ray-Ban display, exploring why Rokit might just be the most practical and game-changing alternative in 2025. When we think about wearable computing, most of us remember the failed attempts of the past, bulky and half-baked ideas like Google Glass and Snap Spectacles that never convinced users they were more than futuristic gimmicks. But in 2025, things are changing dramatically, especially after the recent reveal of Meta's Ray-Ban display, which reignited hype around HUD wearables. And in the middle of that hype stands one of the most intriguing challengers, Rokit, with its newly launched Rokit Glasses. A device that is not only more practical than Meta's offering, but also positioned as a true alternative for everyday users and developers alike. Because Rokit glasses weigh in at just 49 grams, making them almost one-third lighter than Meta's 69-gram Ray-Ban display. And that weight difference alone makes them the world's lightest full-function AI and AR glasses which is a huge deal when it comes to something you're supposed to wear all day. But Roka didn't stop at just engineering a featherlight device. They also built a story around it that is turning heads. Because the launch wasn't just a press release, it was a movement, beginning with the future Insight launch event in New York City on August 26, 2025, where media insiders, academics, and tech leaders got their first real taste of what Roka glasses can do, from real-time language translation to augmented navigation, and even an AI teleprompter tool for professionals. And immediately after that launch, Rokit opened a Kickstarter campaign, which shocked the industry. Because within the first three days, the company crossed a $1 million pledge mark. And within a month, that figure soared past $2.5 million, with over 300,000 units pre-sold globally, showing clearly that people aren't just curious about AI glasses anymore. They are ready to buy and wear them. And that's not a small feat for a category that's been stuck in Concept stage hype for more than a decade, and if you want to take advantage, the Kickstarter is still live until October 10th with big discounts for early adopters. So now is the perfect moment. But let's dig deeper into why Rokit is resonating so strongly. Started with design, at just 49 grams, they weigh less than a pair of standard sunglasses, which makes them viable for all day wear without strain. While offering dual monochrome green micro LED waveguide displays with 640 by 480 resolution per eye, 1,500 nits of brightness, and a 30 degree field of view. This ensures excellent outdoor visibility and reduces eye strain compared to single eye setups like many competitors. Then there's the built in 12 megapixel Sony IMX 681 first person camera that enables HDR, stabilized video, and hands free photography making them a natural fit for content creators, vloggers, and anyone who wants to record from their point of view without holding a phone. But perhaps the most game-changing aspect is the AI functionality, because Rokit Glasses support translation, transcription, object recognition, teleprompter mode, and navigation natively. And thanks to an open ecosystem, they can integrate with ChatGPT, Gemini, DeepSeek, Google Maps, Microsoft Translator, or even users' own large language model, which is a massive difference compared to Meta's Ray-Ban display that locks users into a proprietary ecosystem. This openness means developers can experiment, customize, and innovate just like they do with Android smartphones. And the result is a global tool rather than a closed-loop gadget. So whether you're a consumer who wants your everyday apps or a developer pushing the boundaries of AR, Rokit glasses feel like an adaptive platform and that is supported by a massive community with more than 15,000 developers and 5,000 corporate partners already in China, plus collaborations with over 50 universities and thousands of students. And the company plans to add 1,000 overseas developers in 2025 alone, which means growth and innovation will move at lightning speed. So what does this mean for the average person? Well, imagine traveling in Tokyo or Rome and seeing street signs, menus, and conversations instantly translated right in front of your eyes, or using AR overlays to guide you to your destination without ever pulling out your phone. In work scenarios, imagine live transcriptions of meetings appearing in your view, so you never need to jot notes, or delivering presentations with the teleprompter mode guiding you smoothly and for accessibility. Think about how game-changing it is for people with hearing loss to have subtitles displayed in real time during conversations, while caregivers can rely on AI reminders and object recognition to support dementia patients. Content creators, meanwhile, can record stabilized, 
POV tutorials, live streams, and hands-free vlogs with ease, while everyday users get subtle HUD notifications, shopping list reminders, and AI-enhanced focus tools, making Roket glasses feel like A, natural extension of daily life rather than a tech prototype strapped to your face. And this is the key difference. Roket is practical, and its consumer adoption is showing us that people are no longer skeptical. They're actually ready to wear computers on their faces, which signals a true tipping point for AI-powered smart glasses. And while Meta's Ray-Ban display will capture attention, its closed ecosystem could limit growth and adoption, while Rokid's open model, lightweight engineering, and flexible use cases may be the real driver that pushes AR glasses into the mainstream. So if you're considering backing them, now is the best time before the Kickstarter campaign ends on October 10th, because discount of up to 26% is still available, and early adopters will be among the first to experience what AI glasses can truly offer, and ultimately the future computing may not be in your pocket anymore, but right on your face. And Roket glasses are proof that the wait for practical, useful, and lightweight AI eyewear is finally over, and that's why the comparison with Meta's Ray-Ban display is so important. Because while Meta focuses on branding and ecosystem control, Rokit is delivering actual functionality that consumers want right now, which makes it a practical alternative and perhaps the smarter long-term investment for users, developers, and the entire tech industry. And that concludes our deep dive into Rokit glasses, their Kickstarter journey, their features, and why they may just be the device that finally brings AI glasses into everyday life. And if you enjoyed this in-depth breakdown and want more reviews, comparisons, and tech insights, make sure to stick around and subscribe, because this is just the beginning of the wearable revolution, and you'll find it all here on Techverse.